And now, your first alert weather. Good morning. Live look at Pocatello. Got some good wind speeds coming through here with some rain and snow showers around the region. Not in Pocatello right now. 37 degrees, cloudy, but look at the winds again. 28 miles per hour. That's helping to feel that temperature out to 25 degrees. You need the heavy coat waking up this morning. Unfortunately, live look at the Viper radar. We're getting that, some of those rain showers changing over to snow really quickly. And so snow all the way from Rexburg, up in, even Island Park and Dubois, reaching all the way down to Pocatello and Blackfoot out this morning. Not too much of it is sticking to the ground because it's not too much cold enough, but still getting those snow showers coming down really impressive especially with the winds helping it to almost blow sideways sometimes into the Snake River Plain. The system, if you notice, slowly moving eastward too over and it's going to uh, come into areas like western Wyoming and Jackson, Afton, uh, and in around Alpine too in the next few hours or so. Low pressure just off to our east. This was controlling and wrapping around most of this cold snow behind the cold air of the cold front that came through yesterday. Good news is there's dry weather most for the most part a high behind the cold front out to the west where we do have the slight ridge which is going to give us a break not only for tomorrow on Saturday, but honestly, for the rest of today, we're only expecting these snow showers mainly to be scattered in this widespread, at least in the Sangre Plain, for the morning hours for another round of snow makes its way on through. Heading into the Vipercast, the next few hours, again, you can see some of those snow showers possibly continuing in Pocatello, Idaho Falls, uh, but mostly sticking out to the eastern uh, foothills or so of the Snake River Plain, where we're mostly going to focus on those snow showers out towards western Wyoming and southeastern Idaho. But then once we get into the afternoon and evening, you, think, you see things clear up a lot more, which is going to lead to a nice, beautiful weekend, at least for Saturday, before Saturday afternoon. We'll start with a mix of some showers out towards central Idaho. Saturday overnight into Sunday is when we start getting more of these showers pushing into the Snake River Plain and the rest of the region with a much more wet day ahead for Sunday before finally drying things up on Monday. If you notice, the we're going to have the same pattern of uh, weather, honestly, ahead for Sunday. Low pressure center just off to our east today, and here's the pattern on Sunday. Almost about expecting the same thing with more rain and snow wrapped around another low pressure center that's looking to come through on Sunday, giving us wet weather then. So a sunny day on Saturday and a different tale of a story for Sunday with much more rain and snow chances then on that day. So if you want to get out, Saturday is your day to do it. If you want to get out today, just wait until the afternoon when we can start heating things up into the 40s and 50s then. Eight day forecast in Blackfoot, 54 degrees up to 60 for Saturday and kind of a roller coaster down to the 50s for Sunday before we get right back up to the 60s for Monday. In Rexburg, 53 degrees up to 57 this weekend. Stick with highs on 61 on Monday. Good rain chances again today and on Sunday. In Salmon, 54 degrees. Stick with that for Saturday. And stick with highs around 62 for Monday. Isolated rain chances Saturday through Monday. In Jackson, 44 degrees up to mid 50s Saturday through Monday. Good, good rain and snow chances today. There'll be much more chance of a thunderstorm and much likelier, uh, it's gonna be much more likely, I should say, uh, for us to get a thunderstorm and some rain showers in Jackson on Sunday. In Pocatello, 55 degrees up to 62 on Saturday. Again, just an up down roller coaster. We'll get highs up to the 50s, or excuse me, up to the 60s and then down to the 50s. In Idaho Falls, finally 54 degrees today, up to 56 for Saturday. Stick with a high of 56 down, or excuse me, 50, up to 59 on Saturday. Down to 56 on Sunday, where we kind of just settle into that pattern of up and down in the 50s and 60s into next week. Again, with wet weather expected today and Sunday. Send it over to my buddy, Eric. What's going on in sports, man?